Hi guys, Judy here. I'm walking my dog. And um he um <laughs> he's my rapture buddy. He's my best friend. Anyway, um I'm just having a really good day and you have to kind of celebrate your good rapture days you have because I don't know why, but I'm just in a really happy mood today. <laughs> so Nothing's gone terribly wrong, okay? <laughs> and I'm grateful for that. It's been a low, mellow, relaxing day. And I'm happy. So anyway, I know a lot of times we make videos when we're struggling. So I thought I should make a video when I'm all peppy. And then this, somebody sent me a, a laughing goat video. Dick's creative. You're funny. I like your Thailand videos. I need to go there. It's, I didn't make it to Thailand in my global travels. I wanted to. Um, but I made it almost everywhere else. Um, anyway, so I just wanted to say hello, and, um, and I'm still totally laughing, come on boy, at, you know, at the text I got <laughs> in the last video. <laughs> My family's worried about nuclear war, other family members that thought I was crazy. I think it's funny. Um, I think it's funny. Just, it's funny. Things that God has shown us are starting to actually come true. And we were declaring it before we saw it, which is biblical. And I honestly didn't think we'd see as much as we're seeing before we left. So, come on, Marty, come. Come on. So that's really cool. There's a dog over there that likes to play with mom. Marty McFly, I call him mom because we have this joke. It's a long story, so we say he's a transgender dog. <laughs> we just joke around because he's a boy, but I call him Mama McFly, and it's a huge long story behind that, but he um, is not neutered because I don't need to get him neutered because he's very well behaved. We actually tried to have him have babies with a girl last year but he couldn't get her pregnant it might have been her fault she was seven and uh, I wanted Marty come this way I wanted baby McFlies come on but um come on you little sweetheart we just joke about it he's transgender <laughs> kidding though you guys okay the world's so confused sexually it's just kind of fun to make jokes about it every now and then I was at the high school the other day in a, a band that High school kids put on a band, and their band played the song Everyone is Gay, and all the kids were just going crazy over it. Freaking half the school is. It's just Sodom and Gomorrah. God loves them, and he's going to heal them and set them straight so I don't trip on it. But it does, it does make me sad, you know, because it's just not the way God created it. Their full, ultimate fulfillment and happiness will come from a heterosexual relationship the way God created it. But um, it's okay. It's okay. God's, it's not okay. It's against the Bible. But God, just like every other sin, He's got provision. He's got healing for it, and He's got a way out. And um, that's why I'm saying. Um, and if you struggle with that, or you're on the healing end of it, share God's healing with people. You know, um, don't be ashamed to say what God has brought you through, and help people. I have a friend right now that's helping people in that area because she struggled with it for years and she's on the other end of it. Anyway, I didn't mean to talk about transgender stuff. <laughs> I'm in such a good mood right now. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm wearing shorts. It's a beautiful sunny day. It's going to be hot this weekend. I think we're going to go out to the ocean. Probably not going to go deep surfing, but probably go um, boogie boarding just because it's still tad cold. Um, but we'll put on our wetsuits if we're here. And um, we've had so much rain, it's been annoying. But anyway, I love you guys. Keep looking up. Okay? Make your plans, but don't expect to don't expect to be here for them. All right? Don't. Anyway, love you. Bye. Marty's looking at people kids are playing. Look at that good boy. He is a good boy. Marty's my rapture dog. Love him so much. 
Um, okay, I was going to end the video. I need to end it because it's going to cut off anyway. But if you can, try to get a pet before the rapture. Um, just try. They're just amazing. They're such good companions. I actually certified him as a service dog because where we were living when I got him, you couldn't have pets. And I realized when I was filling out the application that I totally qualified. I have a total disability because I'm rapture-centric. <laughs> I was filling out the paperwork. I'm like, whoa, I, I'm serious, need help. <laughs> since, God, since God made me rapture-centric in 2013, <laughs> I'm like, whoa. But anyway, um, where we're living now, I don't need those papers, but I have them. And as a result, he's been able to go to all the hotels with us when we've left town. But anyway, yeah, try to get an animal if you can, if you're feeling lonely and sad. 